According to a survey by the American Jewish Committee, 26% of American Jews have been the target of anti-Semitism in the last year. 23% of Jewish Americans have avoided wearing Jewish identifying items in the last year. And 19% of Jewish adults under 30 have been targeted online this year. The Anti-Defamation League reports that 2,700, almost 3,000, 2,700 reported anti-Semitic incidents in 2021. And the Associated Press tells us that 40% of American Jews feel less secure than they did one year ago. I hasten to remind us that every word of our Bible was written by Jews, and primarily for Jews. Jesus and Paul were Jewish from the day they were born until the day they died. Anti-Semitism, like all fear-based prejudices that dehumanize groups of people, is immoral, hurtful, and an obstacle to the shalom of God for which Jesus prayed. My clarion call today is to notice the rise of anti-Semitism and to speak out against it when you can. And if you notice how ugly anti-Semitism is, then hopefully it will also help you remember that racism, misogyny, homophobia, transphobia, and xenophobia are also ugly and contrary to the love we are called to embody and share. Remember, the one we call Lord was Jewish. We dare not call him Lord while remaining silent as his kindred are targeted by hate. May God's blessing be upon our Jewish friends. Amen.